What's up YouTube and welcome back to another TPX Reviews. Today's review is another Stain energy drink brought to you by Stain. I mean, but uh, yeah, energy drink from Norway. Um, as it was mentioned to me, well, I mean, I didn't mention this last time, but uh, these are from Norway, but the original maker of battery is from Finland. So thanks to Pop. So yeah. I, Give you a quick shout out for letting me know. Um, so yeah, here's we here we got uh, Barry. Except you know, obviously, he, you know, you remove the E in Barry because for whatever reason vowels are not allowed in these titles. So uh, yeah, so you got some blueberries down here. Uh, you got the word Barry there, and more blueberries up here. Very cool looking plus sign. I think I'm gonna like this one the most because I love Barry. Uh, the only thing I'm kind of sad about is that the top is not gold, but nonetheless, a uh, little shoot out this real quick. Go through all of that stuff. It you know just kind of like give you that chance to just pause the video. There's a whole bunch of stuff in there. Give you a good shot of it. And we're gonna move on to the the caffeine contents, which is always 32 per 100 milliliters, and this 500 milliliters in here so yeah do the math um, yep 50 CL all oh, that's pretty cool I CL I'm not really too familiar with crack it open I think it's gonna be kind of like burn day and a little bit like full throttle agave the blue yep it smells like blueberries except this actually smells really really blueberry-ish, like more than anything we sell here in America. This smells like you just cracked open a brand new package of blueberries. And and it's it's very, very true to the smell. Not artificial. It like has a very beautiful smell of blueberries. And it even looks like I think I've seen blueberry juice before. I'm not too sure. I feel like I've seen it in like some kind of juice uh, carton, and that's pretty much what you got here. Uh, it comes out like a actual blueberry color. Uh, this is, funny enough, blueberries don't produce blue juice. Um, it's more of a purple, but uh, yeah. So let that kind of just sit there for a second. Yeah, it is a very very nice purpley dark. Almost like beet color. But yeah, I've really, so far, I love the smell. I I can't say enough about the smell. It smells wonderful. It's really, really like true blueberries. Um, I get some, a little bit more of an energy drink smell behind it now that it's in the glass. But let's take a sip and see what we think with the taste. Mmm. Oh, it's so refreshing. It really hits the spot. It definitely tastes like blueberries. Um, really, really... Wow. That is the best blueberry. That is the best, hands down, that is the best energy drink I've ever tasted for berries. Like, it knocks pomegranate blueberry rockstar exdurance right out of the park in a way they taste similar except that was like a zero calorie it was like a low calorie type of drink i don't think that's this the case here um so it's pretty much like a blueberry full throttle or a blueberry i think the only thing that comes close is obviously the blueberry the blueberry red bull we have here um i almost forget all about that it exists. Uh, however, I gotta say, this is better <laughs> by far. It's a little more natural tasting rather than artificial. Uh, I really like that. It's got a very, very clean, very crisp, uh, not too heavy on the back. It's very just, it's more, it's like blueberry soda. It's very refreshing and it's very, it's got a great blueberry flavor. It, it's I really like the recipe of, of what made this. It's almost like homemade blueberry juice or blueberry jam. Uh, just 
very pleasant all the way through and yeah it's truly enjoyable um it's the best best blueberry i've ever had i think the last time i had something like this it was a lot thicker and it was called mona v energy drink um same color however i don't really know what that was made of other than a side berry a side berry and blueberry is definitely different for sure but this particular energy drink just tasted very blueberry ish so uh despite being the side berry it had it always reminded me of a blueberry pie and this kind of reminds me of a blueberry pie so without a doubt it's just it's just the nature of um of of these this and the other drink it just has a nice blueberry taste mm. wow it's super good i just it's my favorite this definitely gets a 10 hands down so yeah i don't know exactly what else to really say about it too much um it seems crazy that I have managed to kind of fly through this, uh, but I definitely want to say more. I just don't know what to say. It's probably all the time is saved on the nutrition facts as well as the description, if you know, because the lacquer of there being one. Um, all in all, though, I mean, that's really kind of the short of it. Uh, this is a really, really good blueberry drink, uh, really it's like a blueberry soda, and it's. It's just great. I really like it. Gets a, gets a ten from me for sure, and um, yeah, I really wish that uh, you guys could try this. Um, but you have to, you have to live, I guess, in you know the European parts. Uh, that's funny that the Y gets cut off at the bottom. It's, it seems like there's more of the plus here and less of the Y there. That's a funny little thing. Oh, and uh, I guess while I'm here, I'll show you the bottom of the production code. Every it's interesting that over there they have. They actually have an expiration date, like as if they really are sodas. Like, all right, so this was made February sixteenth, two thousand seventeen, and it goes bad on, I don't know, eight, eighteen, two thousand eighteen. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> eight eighteen. So that's a good one. Um, I would. I don't even know. It almost makes me wonder if they actually expire because Monster doesn't do that. They say when it was made, not when it goes bad. And same thing with Rockstar. I can't even read their code. It always starts with S E A, and I still don't know what that means. Um, so yeah, just all in all, this, thank you so much, Stain. This has been probably my favorite so far of the batteries. I think it goes this one, fresh, and then obviously original. So that's, I think this is the last battery I have from Stain, uh, pretty sure. So thank you so much for these batteries, uh, Stain. Very, very good. Um, honestly, you, you're awesome for sending these to me. It's truly been a really awesome experience uh being lucky to try with these uh so stay tuned to stains burns i have loads of burns to do um i have the original burn but it's a norwegian burn so it might be different than the previous burns i've reviewed but it's always going to be in video i'm kind of like how i have the full throttle of galve up i don't mind revisiting drinks especially if they're from another country uh yet they're same you know origin like the sit still like burn from estonia burn from russia or, or whatever burn from uh, poland and now burn from norway so whether they're different or not i don't care i like to document them and they're also the new burn cans so uh for documentation purposes i want those i do like the old burns i will admit that the old burn cans had a way cooler flame it was more you know shiny and holographic these are kind of flat and you know painted but uh oh well they decided to change them so but uh yeah thanks for guys thanks so much for watching guys i hope you guys enjoyed uh, i know that uh i have definitely enjoyed the batteries they were definitely uh something cool <laughs> really cool looking uh i've heard so much about them when i was doing uh research but i, I didn't never dream i'd ever have one because uh they're from another country and they're so hard to get when you're you know when you live here um that you have to have a friend a good friend like stain so thanks buddy all right guys peace out till next time